Hello to all my friends out there in social media land. Uh, I wanted to do this quick video for anyone who's using a plotter, uh, especially uh, the Roland series, which is what I use. I use the Roland uh, GX24 um, with Cut Studio. I'm on a Mac. Some of you guys are on PC, but this tutorial is for both of you. A lot of guys have been emailing me with questions. They've updated their Adobe Illustrator, and now they can't cut. Um, so I want to guide, walk you through when you update Illustrator, I always keep the older version. So I'm still running Illustrator 2017 CC for my plot. So when you go up to your Creative Cloud uh, to do your update, so it'll typically look like this. You'll say Illustrator. Most of you guys go update, click, 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 and you update it. What happens is it blows away the prior version. Um, I keep the prior versions in. Um, I'm still back on 2015, I can keep it in here, but these I can blow away now. But I always keep at least one generation back. Um, don't worry, if you've blown away older version, there's ways to bring it back in. So I just want to give you a quick walkthrough before you do this. Whenever you update Illustrator, don't ever blow away the old one because you lose your plugins, uh, especially uh, with my Astute Graphics plugins and my Rolling Cut Studio, which means I can't cut. So when you do your updates from here on out, you go to update, it says this, most of you guys go click, and you click right here and you update. You have to go to advanced options. I always leave import previous settings and preferences. That brings you your settings from the last one. And I always automatically, by default, it's checked remove old versions. This will get you into trouble. Uncheck this, and then update. So what's gonna happen now is it's gonna put the new Adobe Illustrator 2018, in this case, and it's going to leave 17. So that way if I have any conflicts, I can still run and design a newer version. If I have any conflicts with plugins or plotting, I can run back and do my plotting from the um, prior version. So I typically, as a rule, wait a minimum of a month before I do an update anyway. Um, typically within three to six months, all the third-party plugins are updated and ready for the new one. So give it time. Just the biggest thing to save yourself the hassle. Don't blow away the old one. Uh, if you did do it, you can go back into Illustrator. Um, you can usually click in and see, you can hit open in other versions. And you can go down and click install. You can go all the way back, to, I can go all the way back to CS6 or CC in 2014. So you can always go back and reinstall it, put your plugins back in, you back up and run them. So hope this tip helps. Um, thank you guys for emailing me and messaging me. They'll, you know, let me help you out with this. So I figured I'd just help some more of you guys out if you're having this problem. Um, have a good week. Happy designing. Talk to you all soon.